a curve C has a parametric equation x is equal to 3 over 2t minus 5 and y is equal to 4 minus 6 over t, where t is a non-negative number, is a non-zero, not non-negative, non-zero number. Find the value of dy over dx. So to find the dy over dx, let x is equal to, we have 3 over 2 t minus 5. So dx over dt is 3 over 2t minus 5 is 3 over 2. That's all. This is 0. Then we have y is equal to 4 minus 4 minus 6 t power minus 1. So dy over dt is minus 6. This is minus 1 t is to the power minus 1 minus 1. So that is equal to minus 6 and minus and minus plus 6 over t square. dx over dt is 3 over 2 and divide over dt is 6 over t square. So dy over dx is equal to dy over dt divided by dx over dt. So that is equal to 6 over t square divided by 3 over 2. This 3 will cancel this 6 by 2 and 2. So 4 over t square. So this is dy over dt is 4 over t square. So we have to find dy over dx, sorry, dx, not dt, this is dx, this is dy over dx. So at t is equal to 3, dy over dx is equal to 4 over 3 square, so that is 4 over 9. Now question number B. Show that the Cartesian equation of C can be expressed in this form. Now in this question if you see, we have y, we have x, but there is no t. So from equation 1, the first equation is x is equal to 3 over 2t minus 5. We make t the subject. Same thing what we are going to do, we are going to make t subject here. t is equal to whatever is there and t is equal to whatever is there. So we will compare both of them. So this is 2x is equal to 3t minus 10. But this 2 is going to multiply by this 5 and multiply by this 6. So, 3t is equal to 3t, 2x plus 10, we have taken 10 this side, so t will be 2x plus 10 over 3. So, this is the first relation we have got in t and x. Now, we are going to take the second equation. Also, we have y is equal to 4 minus 6 over t. We multiply all by t or what we can write is 6 over t is equal to 4 minus y. 
this is 1. Multiply. So, t is equal to 6 over 4 minus y. This I have a, another relation of between t and not x here but y. Now, this is the value of t and this is the value of t. If right side is equal, so definitely this value and this value will be equal. So, we can say from so we can say that from equation 1 and equation 2 what we have deduced that 2x plus 10 over 3 is equal to 6 minus 6 over 6 over 4 minus y. Now, here we have to make y as subject. So, 4 minus y is equal to 18 over 2x plus 10. So, 4 minus 18 over 2x plus 10 is equal to y. So, if I solve it, y will be 6x, sorry, 8x, 4 times 2 is, we multiply it here, 8x, 10 times 4 is 40, plus 40, minus 18 divided by 2x plus 10. So, y will be 8x plus this is 22 over 2x plus 10. I think I can cancel 2 from each. This is 4, 2 time. This is 11. This is 1. And this is 5. So, we have y is equal to 4x plus 11 over x plus 5. So, this is this is A, this is B, and that's all. AX plus B, and this is X plus Y. So, that is the solution. Thank you very much for watching.